basic medicines are not available when people need them the most. This affects rural families, students, elderly people, and disabled individuals who can't speak or hear. The scale is huge. Studies show that 66% of rural Indians don't get timely access to the essential medicines, and many have to travel over 30 kilometers just for a basic treatment. Often, it becomes emergencies. It is important to solve because healthcare access should never depend on distance, timing, or someone's ability to communicate. Namaskar. Our solution is Medicube, a smart automatic medical support system designed to give help instantly and it scans your oxygen, pulse and temperature, identifies what's wrong and dispenses the right medicines on the spot. It supports people who cannot speak or hear through built-in sign language recognition. If the case is serious, Medicube connects the user to a real doctor within seconds. So our Medicube works with two dashboards, a patient dashboard and a doctor dashboard. The, these both dashboards are connected through a server and the patient can communicate with, to the doctor by help of a video conference. The patient panel consists of a recording panel, a prescription panel and the doctor panel have a 5 years record of the patient's medical history. So the doctor can refer and give a secure prescription to the patient. There is the working of MedQ, the doctor would communicate with the patient and if he found that the medicine is available in the MediQ, he would dispense the medicine by clicking on the particular medicine button. Which would start making the which would start making the run the conveyor belt and the medicine would be dispersed in the dispensing box. So far, we have built a fully working medical prototype that can scan oxygen, pulse, temperature, such as the right medicine, recognize the sign language input, and connect a user to a real world through our server. We have also added Aadhaar based medical history reading and anti theft system. In the next 12 months, we see Medicube deployed across schools, villages, and uh, many public areas.